Um, again, guys, if you're losing, if you're, they're asking you to basically just divide. Now, we could use long division or we could use synthetic division. I always think, though, the synthetic division is going to be your easiest um, whenever your divisor is linear. So again, our divisor is linear. So therefore, that's what we're going to do. So you set your divisor equal to 0, and you find your 0, which is 1. Now, in this case, you guys can see we do not have any x to the fourth, x cubed, x squared, or anything like that, right? So what you could do is rewrite this as x to the fifth plus 0x to the fourth plus 0x cubed plus 0x squared plus 0x minus 1. Because what's 0 times all of these? 0. However, when using synthetic division, we have to account for those place values. So I set up my problem with a 1. Then I have 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now remember the first term you always bring down. You multiply on the diagonal. 1 times 1 is 1. Then you add vertical. 0 plus 1 is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. So we have a remainder of 0. So that evenly divides. So that is your remainder. That is your constant. constant, linear, quadratic, cubic, quartic. Well, no, it only goes up to, if there was another one, you'd go up the x to the fifth. You always, I always start from the right. Remainder, constant. So therefore, my final answer is x to the fourth plus x cubed plus x squared plus x plus 1. That is your quotient for that problem. Anybody have any questions on that? No? OK.